Hello. In this video, we are going to see a project the name of a uh, number plate detection using machine, uh, sorry, a deep learning model, model with the image processing. Okay, the main aim of this project is to detect the number plate from the vehicle uh, by using the deep learning model. Okay, uh, in the abstract, uh, we are collecting the data, data sets as in the images and the XML files and get them into the pre-processing method. Uh, then we implement the deep learning model and train with the tra data sets in, with the model. And finally, we can uh, detect the number plates in the images. Okay. Uh, in the existing system, the researcher pro proposed a method uh, to detect to detect the number plates of the vehicle by using the deep learning model. Uh, in this may, uh, by in this method, they use the YOLO method. That that that's the full form is that you only uh, look once. Okay, YOLO uh, algorithms is used to de detect the number plates of the vehicles. But uh, by using this method, we are getting only uh, low accuracy, consuming huge time to detection. And, uh, and 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 needs very large amount of data sets okay but in the proposed system uh, uh, we proposed a model with a deep learning um, uh, to detect the data uh, to detect the num uh, num number plate of the vehicles by uh, vehicles uh, and we firstly uh, first of all we we collect the data sets as in the images Okay, then we, we implement uh, get uh, get get them into the pre-processing method, and we implement the deep learning model. That's the name of Uh, but in the proposed system, we we are using the exception model of the deep learning uh, for the identification of uh, number plate of the ve vehicles. Okay. The advantages of this uh, proposed method is to uh, it it is a very high accuracy and good efficiency and less take uh, time to detect the number plates. Okay. The, this is the workflow of the project. This is the system modules. Uh, first of all, the data collection, then the pre-processing, the splitting the data into the uh, training and test data, and model implementation, and finally detection. Okay. Uh, in the first module, we are collecting the data say, uh, in the, uh, the images and uh, XML files. Okay. And uh, we we get them into the pre-processing method to remove the no uh, noisy uh, values and uh, wrong values. Uh, wrong images and uh, tokenization method and um, uh, to tokenization uh, and uh, get them into the uh, improper images to proper images okay and we splitting into uh, split, splitting the data into the training and the test data we need more uh, data, data for the uh, training uh, so it it, it, it will give us the better accuracy so we are uh, giving our data sets uh, to the uh, training data as 80% uh, of that uh, it, it is approximately uh, not not exactly and we 20% uh, of the data sets will be uh, given to the uh, testing data sets okay and fourth mod implementation uh, fourth model module is model implementation in the in the, in, the, in the proposed system, we are implemented the one uh, deep learning model that are the names of the exception model to uh, detect the number plate of the vehicles. Okay. By implementing the um, data, uh, uh, deep learning model, we can um, we can train the tra uh, training data sets, and after the, the training, the model will be trained. Uh, um, by testing the data sets with the trained module uh, a model we can predict detect the number plates of the vehicles okay this is the software requirements this is the hardware requirements the conclusion is that uh, we can uh, detect the number plates of the vehicles by using the method of the exception model uh, it will give the more accuracy than the yolo method that is uh, the, 
which is existing system we can uh, we can deduct the uh, number of data of the vehicles uh, at, at speed of the in the in very less time okay uh, than the uh, your existing method okay these are the references thanks